Hey guys, welcome back to part 5 of my PlayStation 2 collection. Um, thanks very much for all the feedback I got on my 3 trades videos that I put up um, with Mr Lumpy's handheld retro and grub gun. Um, and yeah, thanks again for um, the wee break from the PS2 collection, just so I could get the rest of the games together. So uh, without further ado, let's get started in part 5. Right, first up, Superbikes Riding Challenge. Nah, it's not too bad. Batman Vengeance. Fucking ace. Lemmings. Because you got to have a Lemmings game on every console, pretty much. Guitar Hero rock, rocks the 80s. I think I picked this one up because it was actually free. Blockbuster were doing um, buy one PS2 game, get one free. I think this was a free game, well, the game that I bought initially was Guitar Hero 2. Alright, Midway Arcade Treasures 2. Picked this one up because it's got a lot of really cool games on it. Uh, Mortal Kombat 2 um, is on here, and that was one of the games I wanted to play. Same as Gauntlet 2, Narc, Rampage, um, Arch Rivals, Total Carnage, and just shitloads of awesome games in that one. Underworld, The Eternal War. I would go as far as to say this is a hidden gem. Um, I think it's a really, really nice game. It plays really well. Graphics are pretty decent as well for the game. The Getaway Black Monday. Pretty decent title. A bit like uh, Grand Theft Auto. V Rally 3. Um, pretty decent game. Really nice condition. Picked this one up at a car boot sale a while ago. NASCAR 06 Total Team Control. Um, I actually got this game for free. One of my friends was moving um, to a different country and he, he left his PS2 collection and um, I had all the ones that were in there apart from this one so I decided to take it. Everybody seems to have this one. Enter the Matrix. Pretty cool game. Roller Coaster World. Because uh, it's a fucking decent game actually. It's not too bad to be honest. I should give that one a go. Lord of the Rings, The Third Age. Um, not a lot of people know that this one's out on the PS2, so well worth picking up. It just seems to be the, the regular Lord of the Rings games and then that one. Smarties Meltdown. I love Smarties, come on, who doesn't? One of the, the very few um, PS2 Platinum games that I have. Um, Midnight Club Street Racing. Not all that interested in Platinum, so... We'll get a move on with the other ones. Lord of the Rings, The Two Towers. Not really my kind of game. More bought from my girlfriend. She loves Lord of the Rings. So, um, yep, so that's her game. Now, a rarer game on the PS2. New York Runabout Neo Age 3. Um, this is quite a rare game to pick up, especially out in the wild. Um, I managed to get this at a car boot sale for 50p. Um, and it's boxed and complete. But uh, for some reason, it is actually quite a hard game to get a hold of. Super Buster Move. Pretty much with the awesome baby in the front. The fucking cool dude with the glasses, man. That kicks ass. Tetris Worlds. Because it's one of the most ported games ever. The Sniper 2. Not all that good, to be honest. Intellivision Lives. This going on from my uh, Intellivision games that I got through from Mr. Lumpy's. So yeah, I've got Intellivision Lives on the PlayStation 2. Also another classic, Space Invaders Anniversary. Can't go wrong with a bit of Space Invaders. UEFA Champions League 2006-2007. Um, probably one of the sports games I actually really enjoy. Um, I do love my FIFA series and I've got... All, well, most of the FIFA's in the PS2, but um, this is actually quite a good football series as well. So a lot of focus on the one tournament, so it's well worth picking up. Uh, and again, this one, UEFA Champions League 2004-2005, pretty much the same thing. Star Wars 2 Battlefront. Um, haven't played this one yet, actually, so I really should get around to playing it. It's not in the best of condition, but it'll do. Right, 18-wheeler. Pretty decent game actually, quite enjoy this one. And for 49p, couldn't really pass that one up. Shrek the Third. 
Definitely my girlfriend's game. Not a big fan of Shrek. And Winnie the Pooh's Rumbly Tumbly Adventure. She loves Winnie the Pooh. So, uh, yeah, this was a must for her. And they are my girlfriend's games, trust me. <laughs> right. Ninja Assault on the PS2. Pretty decent game, actually. Quite a lot of fun. Absolute classic. Tekken 4. Fucking love this game. So good. So different to Tekken 3 as well. It was just an absolute epic game when it came out. I can remember going on holiday to Gran Canaria and reading about this in the... Um, the PlayStation magazine that it was coming out and seeing the screenshots, it just blew my fucking mind that game did. Buzz, the big quiz. I've even got the uh, the buzzers um, somewhere in the house. I'm not sure where, but yep. Scooby Doo, Night of 100 Frights. Yeah, not too bad. Scooby Doo, can't go wrong. Hitman Contract. Um, pretty decent game, still hard with the controls and stuff, but um, yeah, well worth a pick up if you can get a hold of it. It's not hard, it's not that hard to find. Canis Canum Edit. Um, this is um, Bully, I think, in other territories, I think that's what it's called anyway. But um, yeah, it's a pretty decent game this actually, it's a lot of fun. Brave, The Search for Spirit Dancer. Um, I don't even know why I picked this one up. Um, I think I picked it up with the view that my girlfriend was going to play it, but she never got around to it. Um, and I haven't got around to playing it either, so uh, this is probably just going to be a shelf filler, I think. Lord of the Rings, The Return of the King. Um, yep, again, girlfriend's game. Not my cup of tea. Same with this one. Chronicles of Narnia, The Lion, the Witch and the Wardrobe. Um, it does look quite good, actually. I've seen my girlfriend playing this. It does look quite decent. Terminator 3, Rise of the Machines, fucking awesome. I love my Terminator games, and this is, with no exception, this is a fantastic game. I really enjoy it. 007, Agent Under Fire. Yep, I've got two copies of that, so we'll just move on quickly. Final Fantasy X2. Um, yeah, if you'd watched my previous videos, you know I'm not all that familiar with the Final Fantasy series. I am trying to get into them, um, and they're... Some of the games are quite cheap on the PS2, so I picked that one up. And also, the artwork is crap on this one, to be honest. Um, you think they would have put a bit more effort into that. The Da Vinci Code, haven't played it yet. Um, haven't even seen the film yet, or read the book. So, uh, yeah, I'll probably go and watch the film first before I play that game. Spider-Man, a game I've completed uh, a million times. Fantastic game, still a lot of fun to play, even to this day. And Colin McRae Rally 04. Yeah, not too bad. Pretty decent game. Right. On to a bit of an obscure one. Real Fishing 3. Um, and this one is... I wouldn't say a pricey game. But for a fishing game on eBay. Um, this one does go for quite a bit. And it is classed as a rare game. So, um, yeah. I picked it up at Thainston a while ago. So, um, yeah, I'm happy with that. Stitch Experiment. Um, I Disney Stitch Experiment 626. Um, f fuck knows why I picked that one up, to be honest. I, I really don't know. Brothers in Arms Earned in Blood. Not a bad title, actually. Uh, I quite like this game. Yeah, it's, it's very good graphics and stuff. I, I do quite enjoy that one. Poker Masters, because, uh, yeah, everyone loves poker. Well, I like poker. I'm not very good at it. Um, as I was speaking to Darren about it, but um, my friend Darren... Um, but he likes his poker. Uh, I'm not very good at it, but yeah, I wanted to pick it up for the PS2 anyway. Little Britain, the video game. I love the TV series, um, and um, they've got a new TV series out. I think it's Come Fly With Me or something. Um, but yeah, it's it's, uh, mm, it's shit, to be honest. The TV series is a lot better than that. State of Emergency. A really wacky title. I quite enjoy this one. This is This is well worth a look if you can get it. Thunderbirds, because I fucking love Thunderbirds when I was a kid, and this is a cool fucking game. Not. <clears throat> right, Smuggler's Run 2, Hostile Territory. Uh, not all that familiar with Smuggler's Run, but um, yeah, nice game. Pimp My Ride. Eh, why the fuck not? And last one for this video is Call of Duty Finest Hour. And that's boxing complete. Thanks for watching, guys. I shall see you in part six. Take it easy.